Love is in the air, in the thunder of the sea. Award-winning writer, director and producer Baz Luhrmann has long brought his home country of Australia to the world through TV, film, theatre and music. His talent for writing and directing has made him incredibly popular, with adaptations of his work put on all around the globe. Now his theatre production, Strictly Ballroom the Musical, is being revived in London's West End. Lying in my bed, I hear the clock tick. I think they've done particularly brilliantly is the introduction of, of Wally's character because Baz Luhrmann's style, you can't use that in theatre because you can't have these sort of like zoomed yeah. um, sort of close-ups of these characters that are like screaming in a very <laughs> artsy, um, eccentric way. You can't have that in theatre because people are sat in their seats and they're, they're a distance away from you. Whereas Wally can just go around, just introduce and just he play around and just bit, be a bit yeah. mischievous but also quite soulful in himself and just sort of like pieces the story together for us, as, uh, for, for you guys as an audience and I think it really, really worked. He had the magic. Based on Lerman's 1992 film, it's a love story of an Australian ballroom dancer who defies the rules and his dance partner. The musical first premiered in Sydney before moving to other cities across Australia. The West Yorkshire Playhouse in Leeds in England was another stop for the show in 2016. Although all the stage versions are similar to the film, this latest London version has a new character written in to help audiences understand the action. The clock ticks as um, a performer, I sing most of the music as well, and the band's on stage. So it's quite a unique part and quite interesting. I mean, I think what they've done, I mean, if I look at the characters who are all involved in this, from Marius de Vries, who's just won a Grammy, you know, and I've worked with him 12 years ago in my pop career. Baz Luhrmann, Catherine Martin, his wife, and also producer and, and um, designer. It's just, they just, we're all thrown together to create this very individual musical. And, and from all these different worlds, there's film, there's um, theatre, there's pop. It's like, we're just all in together. And then there's the ballroom dancing world, which is used as a metaphor, basically, for the story, which is about being individual and the oppression of individuals. Baz Luhrmann's masterpiece, Strictly Ballroom the Musical, is due to open at London's Piccadilly Theatre at the end of March. <laughs>